Peripheral artery disease is narrowing of the arteries that supply blood to any of your limbs. So it could be your upper limbs, your hands, but predominantly involves your legs. And the vast majority of patients experience pain in their calves when they walk. It limits their ability to walk. The vast majority of them cannot take more than five or six steps before stopping. And some of them can even have pain at night when they have their feet up. And it's just because of the fact that there's so much narrowing and restriction of blood supply to their limbs that the absence of gravity supporting blood down to their legs lead, leads to essentially no blood supply. So they have to get up sometimes and shake their legs just because they're having a lot of pain. Now the treatment for this in this day and age has become revolutionized to the point where a catheter-based process, much like a needle stick, going into either the artery of your leg or the artery of your wrist, where a small catheter threaded over a wire can be passed into the area of blockage. It can be cleaned out, almost shaved out if you like, and then the artery can be expanded back to its normal size with a balloon and possibly a stent. It's almost like the treatment that we have now for coronary artery disease or heart disease, but at a different level. And it takes away major cutting and major surgery that used to be the only foundation of care for these patients. I think this is where, as cardiologists, we can make the greatest impact on our patients. I've seen patients who come in with debilitating disease where they can't walk. I've had patients who have had such bad uh, discontinuation of flow to their, to their legs that they've had their toes infected because the skin is breaking off. I've had patients who have been sent over to me by their podiatrist because they have ulcers in their feet. And all these conditions required a catheter-based treatment of that one segment of their artery, and it completely changed their life.